it's, it's good to see under 19 players being noticed. But uh, as I get older, I worry a little bit more yeah. that about the amount of money under 19 players are getting. We shouldn't be losing under 19 <coughs> players because they're getting too much, too much money. A lot of these boys, Yashir Sivi Jaiswal, it's a very moving story. A lot of these boys have very have come from very underprivileged backgrounds. Great story of his. The fabulous stories. I only hope they manage... Tell us, tell their, us, for people who don't know. I only hope they manage their, their fame and their, and their wealth well. Yashasvi Jaiswal has, has lived in the Maidans of Mumbai so when, when, when he was a child. Yeah. Lit, literally staying in the, in the tents in the Maidans. Yeah. Selling pani put on a stall, whatever. I mean, we, we don't want to highlight the underprivileged nature yeah. of the, how hard he had to work. Yeah. So it's fantastic that players like these are doing so well yeah. and they're being an inspiration to so many others, but we can't lose them because they suddenly got into wealth. I've, I've got a theory. It's maybe a socialist theory in a capitalist era. But I think we should pay them half their money and, and save their money and give it to them at a certain age. No, that's good. I mean, you, it's, it's, not a, it's not socialist actually, it is capitalist. Having a trust you define, in a decide, way. Decide what a maturity age is. Yeah. If you say people are mature at 25, okay, 25, we accept. You think no, 28, okay, at 28, put their money in tax-free bonds so that when they get it, they're not paying tax on it. Yeah. Even if it's 5 and 6% tax-free bonds, but keep some of their money away. I'll tell you who would have liked this idea. Most of the professional boxers in the United States Correct. Yeah, all, went, this is all went bankrupt it's at a later stage in life. When you're young, you don't know what company to keep. Exactly. But this is just me being my age and on, on an iPad. I don't think so. I think I it's being very prudent. I think no. it's, it's very practical and worldly wise advice. About 40% of NBA players go bankrupt after. Okay, Because it's, it's one thing to get wealth at a very early age when you don't know how to manage it. And a lot of them, actually now, they're trying to look at creating exactly, as you said, what we call back-ended contracts, saying at the end of the contract, you'll get a certain amount of money, which will be doled out year after year after year. The old BCC had a benevolent fund. I quite like the idea. Yeah. On your retirement, the moment you announced your retirement, you got your money from the benevolent fund, yep. which they had kept aside. But you know, anyway, that's just Because the IPL is such a young league compared to all the other leagues in the world, right? It's a baby league. It's 13 years old. Uh, a lot of these problems are not coming to light as much as they have in the NBA and the NFL but and all of them. Things. But this is true. It will happen because it's, it's human across countries. It's human. You also have to understand that the tide brings in a lot of under-19 players every year. Yeah. And they're the flavor of the month. So now Priyam Garg has got some money. Yashasvi Jaiswal has got a contract. Ravi Bishno has got a contract. The tide is coming in. Two years ago, the tide brought in Manjot Kalra. He hasn't got a contract this year. Didn't get a game. Didn't get opportunity. He's gone. He's gone unsold. Now suddenly he's looking at the next set of people coming in and, and saying, "Mr. Bus, Yeah, and he's no longer favor of the city. Yeah, so we've got to be a little careful. The tide coming, but it's fantastic that these young players are uh, are getting recognized early. I only hope the danger doesn't move towards staying under 19 longer than you are. Yeah, but I'll tell you one thing. Yeah. This one of the things that you know uh, Ravid did, which is very interesting, is he said nobody will play to under 19. Right. So if you even World if you're 17 yeah. and selected. You're not Last year, Washington Sundar could have played, but couldn't because he'd already played at 16. Yeah. Yeah. Thinking there, of course, was that don't fudge your age. Yeah. The other thing was, after two years, if you're still playing under-19 cricket, you're not good enough, you've not made progress. No, no. Yes. So, go on. Anyway, so Ravi Bishnoi, leg spinner, get, yeah. get, get, get some money. Yashasvi Jaiswal gets a contract. I hope they get to play some games, even if it's three or four games. Discover That's what life no, is no, at no, that level. People he's going to play. Get he's going to play. Because look at the team he's gone to. Just have a look at the <laughs> Rajasthan Rajasthan squad. Yeah. I know a little bit more about Yashasvi because I happen to deal with him professionally. And he has a very good coach. Again, you need that one solid father figure kind of guy. A supervising adult, yeah, there's a man so called, to speak. There's a gentleman called Priyam Singh who's a coach who looks after him, yeah. who's very careful to make sure that the money goes towards family, towards trust. The kid has his head squarely on his shoulders. So, I mean, so far they're doing a very, very good job. It's always tough. And you're always one temptation away from disaster. But I think they're doing a better job in Yashasvi than I've seen in a lot of kids.